Hi, my name is Noah Kandil and I uh, was born and raised in Cairo, Egypt. Um, I did my undergrad at the American University in Cairo where I studied finance and economics um, and then I went to do a semester abroad at St. Andrews, Scotland. So I, I have a very well-rounded, you know, uh, international exposure. Uh, in a nutshell, you know, the main reasons why I uh, am interested to join uh, Bregel Brothers VC as an intern revolve around the three E's and that's uh, engage, encourage and empower. When I talk about engage, what I mean is, you know, to engage with early stage companies, to be able to assess their business model, uh, the founders and basically the inflection point, which is uh, what kind of problem they're trying to solve uh, and also be able eventually to assess uh, whether they can potentially, you know, grow their business 10x or, you know, uh, at a short period of time. The second point is encourage. And by that, by that, I mean encourage to have personal and professional development simultaneously in a very fast learning uh, environment, uh, whether it be in any VC worldwide, especially in the United States. And the third is definitely empower. And by basically empower me to make better sound decisions based on strong analyses that I will learn throughout the process and also you know, throughout my seven years of work experience that I've already learned. So um, my past experience was basically in the investment banking and asset management uh, sector. So financial services, I did that for three years and then I moved on to corporate loan and syndication banking for four years. That's a total of seven years. And now I'm uh, working at an organization called Endeavor, which is basically an organization of by and for entrepreneurs. And we uh, focus on um, servicing and supporting high impact entrepreneurs. Our headquarters is actually based in New York. Uh, our CEO and co-founder, Linda Rottenberg. Um, we have 41 markets. Uh, we are operating in 41 markets worldwide, 37 countries. Um, so it's been a crazy learning experience for me so far. So I believe that the new norm is basically being, being part of a hybrid working environment, especially post-COVID times. Uh, it truly was an inflection point for uh, personal development and also professional development because then uh, um, founders of startups needed to find ways in order to think outside the box and basically listen to uh, the new uh, need that customers might have due to COVID uh, and basically allow them to become more resilient to change. So it's actually been, I've heard and I've sat with a lot of companies that actually COVID did help their business grow exponentially and they were able to pivot their ideas uh, to basically cater to that change. Um, so I believe that working, you know, uh, with you, uh, it will be able to maybe be able me to better assess, you know, uh, entrepreneurs, but also assess them wearing the VC hat, um, and having more of basically a well-rounded view of investments and startups. So basically from an investment perspective, which I'm very much interested in, uh, you know, coming from Egypt and being a woman in the Middle East, you know, it's quite challenging because, you know, not only are you a minority because you're a woman, but it's your minority because you are, um, a passionate woman that wants to uh, work in the finance, the, you know, if you're interested in fintech, if you're interested in just startups, you know, and making, you know, creating your own business, this is, you know, you're the minority of the minority. Uh, and it's been very interesting to see how, you know, the world has kind of opened up and actually, you know, Egypt has kind of opened up to the idea. Still, we have a lot to uh, tackle, but uh, it's been great to be a part of that. And you know, especially that also Egypt, you know, has been the hotspot for investments for uh, VCs and entrepreneurs that have been growing uh, uh, Egypt, Mexico, Vietnam, you know, they have been, you know, a lot of international for and foreign investments have been, investors have been looking at the country uh, for, um, you know, top tier entrepreneurs that really are uh, scaling their business at an exponential rate. So it's been very great to see. Um, you know, and it's been it's been very exciting for entrepreneurship in general and the entrepreneurship ecosystem in emerging markets, especially in Egypt. So not only will I learn a lot from Bregel Brothers, but I feel like I will add a lot of value um, given my background. Um, and yes, it would be great to be a part of the team. Um, and I hope to speak to you soon. Thank you.